Rossum Lopper. I'm with my older sister, Crystal. Hey. Who just so happens to be one of Rossum Lopper's clients as well. Why are you telling my business? But it's just for a traffic today. Today we're going to be showing you how to make a very simple, refreshing, and delicious drink. One of our favorites, a pina colada. It just composes about, about three ingredients in total and it's very simple to make. We know that pina coladas is not the traditional uh, Cinco de Mayo drink of choice. Normally it's margaritas or tequilas or Coronas, the beer. However, let's face it, not everybody drinks margaritas. Not everybody likes tequila. And ladies, with all these Instagram models walking around, we can't be drinking too much beer, okay? So we're gonna hook you up and show you a nice light and refreshing drink that won't leave you feeling bloated, just a little uh, tipsy, I guess. <laughs> Um, however, in recognition of Cinco de Mayo, we are going to take a shot of tequila. Now, we don't really like tequila, so our palates are a little bit bougie when it comes to tequila, so don't judge. Um, uh, but, I don't need to let them know. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be taking a shot of 1942 prior to showing you our very delicious pina colada recipe. So, Get it? Let's get it. It's gonna be Anais's first time, by the way, ever having 1942. So yes, like I said, I guess I'm, I'm like tequila drink. I guess I'm an influence. I don't know if I'm a bad one or a good one, but I'm an influence of some sort. Definitely a bad one. <laughs> but it's so there's yours. She said it tastes the best with the orange slice, right? Oh yes, we're gonna have orange slices, like to, I guess, wash it down. Let me try not And we're drinking it straight. We don't do, we, you don't do 42 chilled. That's still straight, even if it's chilled. Well, whatever. <laughs> Alrighty. Let me cover this just in case. Let me spill it over. And you my little orange slice. I'm not excited about Cheers. this. Cheers. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Happy Cinco de Mayo. <laughs> okay. Mmm. I do not like tequila. You don't like it? But it's not that bad. <laughs> I only did half of mine. Because I'm just like not 100% about that life. <laughs> Maybe 50. Okay. Ew. I feel it in my chest. Wait, you it's so you warm. Like it though? Why is it so like, warm? Like compared to like, a, like Patron. Like this is way better, right? Yeah. I'll do that. It's so nasty. <laughs> The recipe. Okay. So, so warm in my chest right now. Okay. <laughs> um, the pina colada drink that we use, or alcohol that we use, is this Blue Chair Bay. You can use any rum, but we prefer the coconut flavor just because it gives it that extra umph. Um, where did we get this? Publix, right? Publix, Walgreens. Yeah, it's pretty much pretty easy to find, and it's really great. You can even drink it chilled, so it tastes amazing. But um, the first thing we do is put about half a cup of pineapple juice. Can't open it, of course not. <laughs> okay. That 42 is good. I'm still warm in my chest. <laughs> Um, any pineapple juice will do. This one is organic, fancy stuff again. But um, so we put a half a cup of that. You guys can really do any measurements you want if you want to taste more pineapple. Yeah, more frothy. It's really up to you. We just uh, prefer it to be a little bit stronger. So we put about four ounces. Or how many cups did we? Say? We need to put a cup of, of the rum. Okay. So here's the rum. I'm gonna try and not spill it again. One, two. I keep looking on the screen and not at the camera. Three, and four. All right, we got our liquid in. Now time for the good sugary stuff that really gives it that coconut flavor. It's um called Coco Real. I, I think I got this in the juice aisle, but I'm sure you can get it in any Walmart. Um, and all we do is put like a little drizzle. <laughs> and after that, we just put in like a tray of ice. Hi, Ryan. Do you want to come say hi? Hi. That's my niece. 
Um, and we're just gonna put about a tray, maybe 12 ice cubes in total. And then, that's it, right? Uh, yes. Very simple. I mean, you could Sometimes put we put in uh, pineapple chunks, but just to keep it very simple for you guys, we're just gonna blend it right now. <laughs> and then to be a little fancy, we add pineapple chunks. Mine fell in, so. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> Cheers! Happy single them out, guys. Mm. You guys need to try this. Thanks for watching. Mm. Take care. Stay safe.